No chill, no filter. Bitch. What's poppin', what's poppin', and what is poppin' yet again, y'all, y'all know who it is, man, it's your big homie, MC Ron Ski, and this is No Chill, No Filter TV, man, and I am here to do the No Chill, I know a lot of people done did the recaps, I know people done went live, people done been doing their thing, it's all appreciated, but this is a No Chill, No Filter TV recap, so you already know, it's going to be a No Chill, No Filter TV recap, you feel me? Okay, so with that being said, man, let's jump on into it. Now, first off, shout out to my man, G. Gray, the doorman, pops, all them people's, man, they, they be doing their thing, man. I hope everybody continue to show these people respect. When you come in, man, you know, you know, watch your manners, you know what I'm talking about? So, you know, I think they, they deserve the respect, man, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to my man, G. Gray, though, man, UBL, Underground Battle League, Norris was in the house, uh, um, Loyalty. Taking care of her business as usual. You know what I'm saying? Hey, check this out. This is what I got to say about this. I don't know if people is noticing this, but you know, me being a leader, which makes me a great boss, I am seeing the moves. And I'm talking about, when I say I'm seeing the moves, I'm talking about on that level, on that boss level, fam. Um, G. Gray, we talked a little bit briefly. Holla at your boy, man. Holler at your boy one time. Just just, just one time. Just holler at me. You know what I mean? I'm pretty sure we're going to come to a comfortable medium. You feel me? Because right now, man, I think you 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 deserve it, dog. You deserve it. You deserve to reach out. You deserve that no look. You feel me? Rest in peace to the to the man, man. Rest in peace. As I, Speaking of no looks, man. Um, rest in peace, Kobe Bryant, man. Yeah, I mean, uh, is it this right here and then that? Yes, that's what it is, man. Um, yeah, rest in peace, man, to the God, man. That's one of the best that ever done it. I don't know what's going on. Feels feels kind of weird because, you know, that just all of a sudden happened. But you know what? Once again, I just had to take this moment to say, you know what I'm saying? Uh, my prayers and, and, and my condolences go out to his family, man. Oh, my God, man. And with his daughter, Jesus, that is just... Whew, I mean, I, I couldn't, I couldn't fathom it. You know what I mean? You know, and I, I've lost a daughter, lost a mother, and all these things, man. And I still just, you know, I feel the pain. Okay, so you know, rest in peace, Kobe Bryant. Okay, let's keep it popping. Okay, like I said, hey, check this out, man. You, you deserve that no look. Holla at me, man, for real. We gonna, we gonna get something cracking. Um, yeah, and I see, boy, y'all. Woof. Hey, that them UBL events is starting to be events. Everybody be showing up. Did, did anybody duck? Um, Zilla wasn't there, so was was Zilla supposed to be there? Oh yeah, yeah, I do believe Zilla was supposed to have battle shadow, right? Okay, whatever the case, man, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Uh, shout out to the UBL, man, Battle League. And that's still, because cause UBL, okay, you know what? We're not going to do that right now. Okay, I'm overthinking things. Okay, man, so we're going to jump right in it. When I got there, you know what I'm saying, um, Logic Divine. Yeah, Michael Max Academy, a nigga oh. picked on me. I stole a 22 and swore to myself I was popping his ass. He used to skip a couple periods in the bathroom. I started waiting there. And he graduated at the top of his class. Ooh, Trauma man. victim. Oh my God. Yo, Yo, get the food. Trauma victim. Trauma, Trauma victim. Was already probably like in the middle of his round and he was cooking versus show enough drama. If he say the wrong thing, I'm taking off. This nigga out here licking white bitch pussies, eating pork, breaking laws. <laughs> <laughs> Breaking laws. <sighs> you know, I agree with uh, with Mike G when he said that you know content is is what won that battle, and I I, I can I can agree, but I didn't hear I didn't hear uh, Logic Divine's you know full round, so I can't say what was what, but I think both of them got off. But yes, um, I think show enough. So enough actually got got um, top tier. He got top tier presence. He got he definitely got them bars for real. Um, he just gotta kind of season up a little bit. But for real though, 
his 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 bars were still on point you know what i'm saying so because i didn't see logic divine's whole round i can't really judge that although i heard some people say logic get, uh, took it and i heard some people edging it over to uh show enough drama so y'all gonna have to wait till that battle actually drop for y'all to actually make a a decent you know um actual recap or should i say a decent judgment on that to say who did what or who won but if it was up to me it would be kind of one-sided because, like I said, I didn't see Liza Devine's whole whole round, you know, unfortunately. Speaking of not seeing, I didn't see, like, the first three battles, but there were eyewitnesses. Let's take a look. All right, no chill, no filter TV. We got Lady Loyalty here. She finna tell us, uh, actually finna recap, like, the first part of the night. I'm just getting here. I'm kind of late. Yeah, you late as hell. Yeah, I know, man, but, you know, I'll never do this. What was yeah, it, I mean, I think it was, was it uh, President versus what's his name Creed? Or something? Is that the first Creed? Yeah. So Prez did his shit. He okay. did his shit. Uh, it was one of them battles where you looked at Creed like, "What you finna say, nigga?" <laughs> <laughs> he got off. What the fuck you finna say? Okay. But Creed held his own. So I gave it to Creed because he edged it. That's the first battle. Yeah, first okay. battle. Okay. Second. Um, who the hell did we have second? Uh, Mike G. Mike I know G. you said you said Mike G. Mike G. Mike G. Mike G battle, versus okay. Keys. Okay. Uh, yeah. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, that's right. Mike G battled Keys. Battle. How did that go? Body. How did that go? <laughs> yeah, Keys tried some. They said I can't touch you, and he touched Mike G and Hulam Gang. Went oh up. no, I yeah, missed that. Yeah, you missed it. <laughs> <laughs> you missed it, but you ain't kept it cold steady. We okay. calmed it down. Most definitely, most definitely. He got his shit off, but it wasn't enough because Mike G came in and bodied that boy. Yeah, oh, yeah. Back. I know oh. Mike. I know Mike G ain't got to get physical. No. He got them lyrics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He got off. Okay. Shout out to the man Keys. Um, Thanks for coming through. Oh, we just had Jay Lopez. Jay, uh, no, that was uh, uh, Jay Lopez J. Lopez battle. Yeah, Jay Lopez battle. Who, 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 I battled uh, Zapreem from. Uh, oh yeah, Zapreem. How did that? How did that? How did that work out? Uh, what? Yeah, he choked. Wait a minute, hold on. Come back here. Zapreem choked. Zapreem choked on this man right here? Yeah, he did. Oh, jeez. Yeah. I, I just, that, that's just crazy. I, it was bad for him. If it wasn't, if it wasn't for my babies and my grandbabies and stuff like that, I'd have caught all this. Good Lord. Yeah, so he choked. Uh, J. Lopez went first. Yeah, yeah. And um, yeah, he tried to all. say some shit at the listen, end. Listen, I'm still, I'm still, I'm still we got Zapri right here. Right here man. Oh, that's Zapri? Yeah, that's him. Yeah, okay. You know what I'm okay, uh, what you got to say about your performance then, there, brother? It happens, huh? It happens to the best of us, right? Hey, man, I had fun tonight, man. That's, that's what's up, man. That means a learning experience. Most definitely. Hey, where you coming from? Peace of the gods, man. Where you coming from? New York, Lower East Side. Oh, you come from the... Oh, okay, okay. You by yourself, you know what I'm saying? Oh, man, that's what's... No, you ain't by yourself, brother. Don't don't worry about it. You 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 100, you 100 up in here. Okay, all right. Either way it goes, decent battle. I wish it would have went better for you. Next. Um, who the hell just battled? Uh, Dante Credo went against Class President. You got that? Yeah, I got that. Oh, yeah, the Class President. President, uh, showing up drama. That was drama showing up. Versus, yeah. Uh, drama versus logic. Yeah, I kind of saw that um, one. I came in at the towards the end of drama versus logic. Um. Uh, yeah, I saw that. Yeah, funny. I saw that. Dog drama told that nigga he out here breaking laws. That shit had me. Yeah. <laughs> Eating, eating out the white right girls and eating pork bitch. and all of those shit. they both did their thing. I'm looking. Okay, salute to drama because you got through your shit. For sure. Salute. salute. My man. There he is. And, um... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Here, right? So who won? Well, that's what I'm trying to try. see. Uh, who won between Logic you know who won. Uh, and so now? No, no you are biased game. Get your ass off my camera, boy. Get your ass off my camera. He biases the motherfucker. Okay. Um, like, we, like we were saying. Anyways, uh, uh, what you said? That's, okay. I, I got to see it on camera again, but I, I'm edging in the building to, uh, to drama because he had more aggression. His bars was there. He finished his shit. It was a surprise. So, okay. Because Logic, he came, he punched. You know what I'm saying? He did what he normally do. Right. Didn't nobody expect drama to do what he did. So, so you you giving you you edging that over to I'm drama in the building? Yes, I'm most okay. definitely gonna have to see it on camera again though. All right, all right, okay. Well, this is no chill, no feel the TV. Well, who's you again? <laughs> Lady loyal, <Loyalty>. chunky. <laughs> Okay, yeah, that's what's up, man. I appreciate you. So you already know the recap gonna be crazy for the rest of this. I guess I gotta sit for the rest of it. Who we got next? Um, we still got we got Kooji, we, we got Hoodlum, got Hoodlum and Show, um, we got Larry, got Larry Bull. Man, we still got plenty shit going on. Oh, uh, we got one more, Chris Nitty and King Bass. Yep. Are they both here? I seen Chris Nitty. It's King Bass here. I don't know. I haven't seen him. Okay, cool. Okay, man, and let me let me explain something to you, man. 
if you gonna go up against the likes of people like 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 J Lopez, Bankhead, Kooji, fam. You, you, the chokes are are pretty much you know what I mean you you can't cause you already you already in the fight of your life you can't be running out of bullets man cause you already know it's war you know what I'm saying so bottom line is you know well y'all heard that recap so you know appreciate it to the lovely lady loyalty you know what I'm saying um okay let's just move right along um you know what I'm gonna let lady loyalty help me out with this alright no chill no filter TV quick recap with lady loyalty What's popping? Oh my god. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that shit was so dude, these battles been fire. Fire as all hell. All night been fire, fam. And they only all one rounds. That's the crazy all part. All one rounder. What the fuck is this crazy? Y'all already know. Okay, so let's jump right into Wait, it. Did we do cool uh uh cool G already? No, no we did not. Okay, so we're gonna start with him because he went first. Yeah. Cool G. Him, sorry. Man, and you do you know the young dude? What's his name? Paulo? Paulo? Hey, he pointed at me like, yeah, man, you the one did the recap. You yeah, watch this. Yeah, uh, yeah. Watch what? I'm like, yes, I you am watching like he this. He sounds like a bootleg Reed Dollars. Oh man, I you know what? I, you, bottom line is, he lost. Kuji stood there and he let dude get his bars off. And Coogee came through and steamrolled the whole situation. Yes, he did. Okay. All right, on to the next one. Man, Hood Larry versus... Nope. Oh, no, Larry Boy, Larry right. Boy. Versus Prophecy. Yes, it, that was a good battle. I Maybe thought Prophecy kind of like had him because, you know, sometimes Larry Boy can... It can was, start kind of, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, he can start and then lose it. Right, I, right, that's what you right. But uh, it wasn't the case of that. Larry Bull done Larry seasoned Bull. his that meat. That nigga was like, uh, yeah. mm, get 112 and no faith. But see, I ain't worried. He ain't worthy. I'm in the game. You bring jerseys. He bang nerdy. The thing curvy. Put scopes on the 40s too. James Worthy. Uh, oh, that was right. Nice. Damn near every bar, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> Yeah, Larry Bull got that the fuck off. off. He was getting off. So privacy, he did his, he did his thing. Yeah. But then Larry Bull rapped. Larry Bull took care so of it. So I, I, I got Larry Bull on that. Most definitely. And then. Man. <laughs> talk about it. Let's talk about Showstopper. Showstopper versus Hitler. Versus Hitler. Now, uh, Showstopper, I ain't never seen him almost like choke. Uh, yeah, yeah, he, he did, did that twice this battle. He, he brought it back. He brought it back. I'm he not saying. I said almost. I right. did say almost. Right, right. Um, but I ain't never seen him in that element. So right, right. I don't know what it was. Yeah. But this motherfucking hood. That hood just his pen was pushed. <laughs> Woo! That my nigga goodness. Said, he said, "Sis, I've been going through some shit for the last two days," and he put that shit in all his motherfucking energy. Yeah. Today. You know what? People always say that. You know, he always talk that shit about the hood. They say he do it too much. You know what, Hood? What, 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 what you first off, before I say what I got to say, what you got to say to Hood right fast? Bro, that mother talk, that's how the fuck you Keep rap. talking that that's real shit. That's how the fuck you shit. rap. You said I rap about jail too much. Dumb nigga, you really think I'm proud of that shit? Missing my baby birth, B-days, grain glass breath. I'm oh, talking man. memories I never oh, get. Talk, yeah. nigga looking in the photo oh. album, the closest feeling it is, 32, then in 14 years in the system. So you think I'm proud of that shit? But that blow through the phone plus fry, that was some funny shit. Right. But if you was on the other side of that wall and that fat bitch wasn't picking up, I bet it won't be funny then. Oh! 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 You, you. Yeah, keep <laughs> talking, you talking that real. Cause that he one, that out the bar, gate. That one bar he told him when he was like, uh, some, some, some. I'ma shoot you in your head, and uh, I pray that you live through the shit. Yeah. So you can tell the police that weak ass motherfucker slogan. I don't, I don't remember, remember that, that shit. shit. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> yeah. Got clean the fuck off. So yeah, he yes. Jabbed. That okay. dog. He got off. Hull him. I'm giving it to Hull him. All right. So one, two, and three, right there. We got uh, Kooji. Oh, okay. Damn. Yeah, yeah, Hullum is like pretty much flawless for the evening yeah, then, that, huh? Yeah, that's what it was, all Hullum game. <laughs> Look at Dog. Look at Dog. Where Bull at? <laughs> yup. Yup, he done that. Hey, rest in peace to the guy, man. Yeah, for real, yeah, for man. real, Nothing to dog. do with that battle. In real, real life, my man. Yeah, okay, uh, man. Get out, Daddy. Okay, y'all, that is my recap in its entirety, man. You know what I'm talking about? But, I can't leave here yet, man, because I didn't say nothing about Chris Nitty versus King Bass. Okay, King Bass did better than last time. That's for damn sure. Um, because the last time was actual was a totally complete disaster. Um, 
he just I guess he he just slept all his lyrics or something like that his bars or whatever so that was last time and that was a UBL event also but this time he actually he actually did well um, that was just you know a little bit of you know stuff that lets you know you know what I'm saying need a little seasoning um, yeah uh, it was King Bass versus Chris Nitty and Chris Nitty left Earth honestly Chris Nitty left the planet and oh man I, I don't even want to use that analogy crashed and burned but um, pretty much that's 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 what he did and I know people are like man you know you know you can't gauge this and that and I understand you know because you know it's 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 a lot of mixed feelings about the Kobe Bryant situation, right? Because you need to understand something. Okay, now people saying you better not say nothing about Kobe Bryant, but all at the same time, you know, when the young lady, uh, Kanika Jenkins, was found in the, in the in the freezer, I was hearing a lot of, you know, bars about that that were pretty off to the left. You know what I'm saying? So I don't want to gauge his... I don't want to gauge this win or loss on, you know what I'm saying, saying something too soon. But I'm not going to say that he shouldn't have said that when people, you know, pretty much took a young black girl's life or death, should I say, um, kind of like for fun. Like they just they didn't take it seriously because I heard a lot of Kanika Jenkins um, um, bars that were, you know, just way too soon. Actually, I don't think anything should be said about Kanika Jenkins if you ask me unless you're talking about you know what happened or somebody is you know revealing who actually killed her or what happened or whatever the case <clears throat> but yeah um, I don't think that people should be mad at this man for you know screaming that about Kobe and you know not really coming down on people for you know screaming those bars about Kanika Jenkins so if you are a true Kobe fan, you would definitely say Chris Nitty lost because of the bar at the end. And he did say, man, I probably shouldn't say this. And honestly, you know, you probably shouldn't have said it. Honestly, man. Because you, 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 you already killed him. You, are, you, have, you already had him dead. So you really didn't have to use that bar. And then like the little push, you know, somebody pushed him into you and you pushed him back. And then people kind of got kind of almost in the uproar a little bit. You know, that was kind of unprofessional, but, you know, I understand, you know, people was, you know, drinking, you know, having a good time and stuff like that. But we all got to we all got to remember, you have to keep a certain level of professionalism. Everything got to remain, you know, and that's kind of like what I'll be saying, like about people need to really kind of like, you know, stay, you know, you know, you don't have to really, you know, do the whole in your face thing, because I know that that can get kind of serious with that being said man this your big homie mc ronski and i hope y'all enjoyed my recap there's no chill no filter tv and i'm about this bitch no chill no filter <laughs> tv bitch <laughs>